Hey everybody, it's Nicole from Cause We Love to Scrap. Um, today I'm working with the June Shimmers Color Kit Bundle. And um, I already started to build my layout. I wasn't sure if I was gonna do a process video or not, but then I decided, you know what, let me just make a process video. So let me tell you what I did so far. I have my mixed media paper, my foundations paper for the background here. And then I have um, this purple heart paper torn about right there. And then I have underneath that is this big floral paper. And on top of that is um, I cut from this sheet of green paper, I cut the top part off so that I could have this as a little border piece. So that's my paper piecing on this. I also um, have this picture of Stirling Castle in Scotland and I have a mat of this green paper and then I have a bigger mat of this pink polka dot paper. I'm gonna put it right here. And so what I did was I um, went ahead and put some um, heavy white gesso down on the pattern papers right there to get this ready to use the paints that came in the kit. So here are the paints that came in the kit that came come in this kit. We have punchy pink inklings and shimmers Moulin Rouge and these are what they look like. Then we have um, sweet pea spritz. We have Frostbite Vibes and a Colorings Keep Palm. So um, I'm gonna try and use some of those here on my layout, some up here, some down here. Um, I'm gonna go grab my water and then we're gonna get started. Alright, so the first thing that I'm going to do is I'm going to um, get that Moulin Rouge um, paint. I'm going to put some water in it to get it activated. And I'm going to take this Shimmers, um, maybe this is the Moulin Rouge. Yeah, I think this one is the Moulin Rouge. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and paint on this, these around, <laughs> there we go. And then I think this is the punchy pink and um, I'm going to go ahead and add that now that it's all activated with the water. I am going to add a little, oh no, first I'm going to add some of this sweet pea and it is a bright purple color, goes perfect with this paper. So I'm going to go ahead and kind of blend it in with my brush and add some more water as I'm doing that just to get it good and moving around and then now I'm going to come in with the keep palm this is a nice very vibrant green I'm really liking it especially next to the pinks and then I'm going to come in with the blue color um, which I already forgot what it's called, uh, but I'm just going to add it in those two spots. Oh no, I think I bring it in in one more spot. Um, I didn't like that it wasn't vibrant enough, so I'm just going to take off the lid and dip my brush in there and add some as um, needed, as you can see there. And then I'm going to go ahead and just splatter this one around, just for some fun. I didn't splatter anything else, which is odd because I love, you know, I love my splatters. So here is what it is looking like, uh, nice and dry. So the first thing I'm going to do is put down my photo and I'm going to use some um, 3D dimensional phone tape. I don't know if that's what it's called. That's what I call it, I guess, today. <laughs> anyway, um, and then I'm going to go ahead and put it on my layout. There we go. So that is down and ready. Um, now I'm going to grab my ephemera and I'm just going to uh, go crazy with all of the flowers and then I'm going to use the word beautiful from the ephemera to be my title in this page.
So I did go off camera and I glued and um, taped everything down and now it's all secure. So uh, I decided I wanted a little bit extra fun on this. So I'm going to go through my layout and just add some little clusters of circles here and there and I'm, they're just doodled on uh, just to add that extra interest to this page. So now I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to add my journaling down at the bottom. Um, just saying again that this is Sterling Castle and we were there in March. Um, that's going to be it for my layout. So thank you so much for watching. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe. If you decide to grab this kit um, or anything else at the Shimmer Shop, don't forget to use my name, Nicole. Um, in the shopping cart, there will be like a note section and um, you'll get a freebie with your purchase. I will have links to this kit and the shimmers page uh, down below in the description. Thank you so much for watching today. Until next time.